Hi, I'm Patty. Welcome to WUFT and Cade Museum Summer Camp. In 1905, something serendipitous happened. Frank Epperson was 11 years old. Now Frank Epperson took some water in a cup and he mixed it with sugary drink mix and he left it out in the backyard overnight and it was a cold night. The next morning, Frank woke up to a frozen sugary treat. We call these popsicles, but you see, Frank Epperson is the reason why we have popsicles. Now it wasn't until Frank got married and had kids and his kids knew that their dad invented this frozen treat. And they said, Pops, we call you Pops. It's not an Eppersicle, it's Popsicle because Pop invented it and they referred to their father as Pop. So my friends, I'm gonna show you in honor of Frank Epperson, the original idea man of the popsicles, how to make your own at home. I have some beautiful strawberries. I have some fruit juice. This is our favorite juice to use at the Cade. Gatorade. You've got to have some Gatorade on a hot summer day. But you can use soda pop, fruit juice, or lemonade, whatever you have. Now, ask a grown-up to assist you when you are cutting up your fruit. It's very important that we have safety. I'm gonna take some frozen strawberries in mine. I'm going to use, I'm, I feel kind of soda poppy today. Because I have strawberry kiwi here and I'm putting fresh strawberries in. I think it goes together. And then I'm gonna take a piece of foil. Now the foil is gonna go over the top and pinch the sides down to hold it securely. Always ask your grown-ups for help. Now we need to put the stick in it. Popsicle sticks are great, craft sticks, you can get them at the store. Now my mom gave me some little wooden hors d'oeuvre sticks to use and they work too. you set it in like this and you put them in your freezer and in a few hours we used in our first batch wax lined paper cups which are easy to pull off I put in this one a slice of lemon so it's gonna be a lemony strawberry fruit punch. And I threw some strawberries in there too last night. Can you use bananas? Sure. Can you use chopped up carrots? You can put anything you want in your popsicles because do you know why? You're inventing them. And if your name is Jones or Smith, you can call them Smithsicles or Jonesicles. Remember, you're the inventor.